are doing a community paint day to include as many people as possible to help us paint this mural on the subject of work. We're like painting around with the brushes. We have to, they're writing, they're writing with pencils on there, and then you get the paintbrush and then paint inside of the inside of the lines. So we've been working on this project since last year around this time. Um, we really fully started in October of 2011 with a whole slew of community meetings and uh, conversations to really help the artist team figure out what this mural was going to look like. Our main message that we came up with, which is on the mural itself, is that work unites us. That we're brought in contact with people through work that we may never have been brought in contact with in other forms. We're, you know, we're with our families, like it or not. We're with our neighbors, our communities. But work brings us in touch with people to run something in our society that um, we all have to have a common goal and make it happen. So that idea translated into these paintings from the perspective of this mural is literally being played out. Um, we had a collaboration as an artist team and now we have a collaboration as a community. We are here because Veronica Rose goes to Children's Village and this mural is going to go on the wall outside their building so we thought it would be a great thing to do to bring her so she could see it every day we go to the school. You can see point to it and she'll have a part of it. So we'll be able to say, hey, look, you painted that square right there. And that's kind of what we did. Um, right now I'm painting E15. <laughs> um, I'm trying to make a part uh, to help the mural, you know, grow and be a part of it and enjoy the experience, get lost in it. Cause there's always something therapeutic about art, in my opinion. The whole mural will be done over the course of um, August, September, and into October, and the dedication will most likely be in November.